Hey, it's John F. M. K. N. Making a video here on my fish tank. Um, suffering a little setback here. Um, you can see there's a female guppy here. And if you look at the back end of her, she's got worms sticking out of them. Uh, I looked online and these worms are called calamana less worms. I'm not sure if I'm pronouncing it right, but I'll, I'll write it down in the description. And they're these little red worms, and they're sticking out. You can see them right there. Her vent. And from doing research, um, these are really hard to get rid of. But um, from what I found, a dog dewormer works. And this is what I'm using. It's ProSense Safeguard. And the main ingredient is fenbendazole. As long as you find a dewormer with that ingredient, the fenbendazole, it should work. And this has, I think it has like three little packets. I'll show them to you. So, it has a little pack like this. Pouches one gram. Um, so what I did, I just dumped one pouch in here and it kind of coats everything as you can see. And um, I just been feeding normally um, and I even have shrimp in there and it hasn't affected any of the shrimp or anything. So I think it's safe for shrimp. I don't know about snails. I don't have any snails in here. But um, all the fish seem to be doing fine. Um, I just hope um, these worms start dying. Um, but I think for the directions, it's um, you treat for, I believe it's like three days, then do a large water change. And um, two weeks later, treat again. Um, and then two weeks later, treat again. Um, to get rid of you know all the worms because they have like a life cycle and you might get them all the first time so um, that's what I'm trying um, if, if you guys have any other methods of getting rid of these worms please put them down because I think a lot of other people would like to know I, I found it really hard to find information on, on these treating these worms so if you guys have um, other methods please put them down Thanks for watching.